Cladera Manager provides centralized, end-to-end administration for CDH. It's the most effective way to manage Hadoop clusters of any size. In this demo, we'll show you how easy it is to deploy a CDH cluster via our simple, wizard-based interface. Let's get started. The first step is to log into Cloudera Manager and register. Registration is optional, but it's very important as it allows us to keep you up to speed on product features and updates. Next, specify which servers will be part of your CDH cluster by entering the host names or IP addresses. You can search for hosts by entering IP address ranges and wildcards for host names. Cloudera Manager then finds the selected hosts and test response times. Now select which version and release of CDH you want to install. Cloudera Manager 4 supports both CDH3 and CDH4 clusters. Next, provide SSH login credentials for your hosts. You can specify a passphrase or select a public or private key file. Now that you've identified your hosts and provided login credentials, Cloudera Manager will install the CDH and Cloudera Manager packages. After installing the packages, Cloudera Manager performs an inspection to ensure that each host is properly configured to run CDH. It checks to make sure that they're running a supported operating system, have the correct versions of Java and the CDH components installed, time settings are consistent, and they can communicate with each other properly. Next, you can select which CDH services you wish to start on your cluster. Depending on the workloads you wish to run, you can select Core Hadoop, HBase, All Services, or a customized subset of your choice. For this cluster, we'll select All Services. Now Cloudera Manager will configure the databases for the Activity Monitor, Service Monitor, Host Monitor, and Reports Manager components. By default, a Postgres database is created, but Cloudera Manager can also be configured to use Oracle or MySQL databases. Next, you'll review some key settings for the services you've chosen to start. Each service has been automatically configured, but now you have the opportunity to make changes if you wish. It's important to note that since Cloudera Manager manages more than 700 configuration settings across all of the CDH components, only the most important settings for each service are exposed here. The last step is to start the CDH services. Cloudera Manager automates this process and ensures that the steps are completed in the correct order and that each service is running according to specification. And lastly, once the cluster is up and running, Cloudera Manager takes you to the home screen, where you can easily view the status and health of each component running. Thank you for watching this product demo. For more information on Cloudera Manager, please visit cloudera.com/cm4.